Channel 3 is your election authority, and with Election Day on Tuesday, we hosted the only debate between the candidates fighting to represent you in one of the U.S. state Senate seats here in Connecticut. Channel 3 Eyewitnesses reporter Audrey Russo is covering the biggest issues discussed in that debate last night. Audrey, good morning. Wendell, good morning. Democratic Senator Richard Blumenthal and Republican challenger Leora Levy went toe-to-toe -to -toe on a number of issues, including inflation, government spending, the economy. But they also highlighted their stances on one dark horse issue that a lot of experts believe could play a big role in the outcome of the midterm elections nationwide, and that's crime. Now, a few months ago when we did our CT Insider, WFSB, and Western New England University poll, the voters told us that crime was an important issue, although they didn't rank it as their top concern. Still, the candidates last night tried to position themselves as tough on crime. Levy used that as an opportunity to name check a major law enforcement endorsement that she's gotten. I was endorsed by the state fraternal order of police because they know that I will always have their backs. I supported a bipartisan measure to penalize any city or town that defunded the police. I think we should be providing more funding. We have to hold the police accountable, but we also must give them the support. Now, when it comes to who won the debate, we took a look at some of the reaction on social media, and it seems to be pretty mixed with both sides saying that their candidate won and that the other candidate lost. So that's obviously something that we're going to continue to keep monitoring. But as it stands right now, the reaction on social media is pretty partisan at this time. Now, coming up in the next half hour, we'll have more information on how the candidates came down on another big issue on people's minds, and that's the economy. Live in Hartford, Audrey Russo for Channel 3 Eyewitness News. Audrey, thank you.